Hey, Nomi's, guess what? We made a major upgrade to the Gnome's Den. You wanna see? I know you do. Can you say game changer? Look at him go! Let's check it out. Okay. Okay, here we go, Nomies. This is a 2007 Polaris Ranger. Six um a by um a six um. That means there's six wheels. Right on the side. Right on the side. Six by six. Ranger. And oh my goodness. Did we get a super deal on this? Gentleman had it since new. 2007. Garage kept. Once a year moves something. He's done some good upgrades. Got some racks on the top. He put the cab on here. Oh my god, I'm gonna yeah, let me let me get the tripod, I'll set this up and I'll check we'll check some of this stuff out later. Alright, now we, before I get too involved in the tour here, oh, by the way, brought it home last night in the rain, had to drive it home so it's dirty. It was clean when I got it. Anyway, this little machine right here, if it wasn't for people out there seeing what we're doing here, working hard with what we got, pulling stumps by hand, Building shit with what we got. Surviving. Making it happen. And again, if it wasn't for you guys out there believing in us, this wouldn't be possible. We had a little bit of money saved aside for getting one. We were waiting for some grants to come through, but we had some Nomies pull through for us and say, hey, I want to help you out. This blows me away. Because wasn't for you guys. We'd still be pulling stumps by hand. Alright, let's get back to the tour. Okay, so what do we got here? We got a full cab, okay? Rain? No? It ain't coming in there. We're staying dry. Awesome. And if we want to, see, slide right off. Boop. Leave the side so we can just easily, easily get in and out. So, six wheels. Three on this side, three on the other side. When you do not have it in all-wheel drive, it is four-wheel four -wheel drive, four-wheel drive in the rear. Click the little button, which I'll show you later. <laughs> she goes, boy. Anyway, where was we? Six wheels. Check this out. Hydraulics assist. Oh. That's going to be so much easier than a wheelbarrow. What else? What else? What else? What else? Let me take you out the stand here and I'll give you a closer look. Okay, so we got windows that roll back. Cushy seats. We can fit three in here easily. And what we are going to do is we're going to put a bench seat back here for two more. Have it set up a little bit higher. That way when you're out moose hunting, you get got a good place to spot. People sit back there and then we can fit more peeps. More gnomies. Okay. Tailgate. Beautiful. This has a hauling load of 1,400, no, 1,000 pounds. And a tow load of 1,500 pounds. So, I think the overall load with three people um, is 1,800. It's like 600. I, I don't know. I looked at the numbers. It's good. So, what else we got? These tires are in amazing shape. Almost new. Not quite. I think they had a couple trips on them is all. But when you're riding trail, they shouldn't wear out. Brand new. Warren Winch. 3,500 pound winch. We got a little remote control deet, 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 for using it. This right here. You put a pole in here with a pulley and you lift your hindquarters up. Get your meat off the ground so you can work on it up here where it's easy. <laughs> Isn't that awesome? Under here there ain't much. There's just some electronics. 
I thought there'd be a frunk under there, you know, place to store stuff, but they didn't. What's up, Polaris? My Kawasaki had that. Anyway, nice big wraparound bumper. Goes back here to the frame. So you ain't gotta worry about messing up the front end too much if we ever, if we ever hit something. Eight gallon capacity tank, very, very fuel efficient. Um, this is not made for speed. It's made for going low, slow, and getting her done. And that's what she does, boys. Um, nice rack on the top. Aluminum, you don't want to put too much up here because you do not want these things top heavy. If you're going down the trail and you get on a trail that's got a little bit of grade on it, you do not want any help going over. I'll show you the motor here in a second. Actually, I can show you here. Now, I think, lift this up. The motor is in the center and down low, which helps tremendously with your center of gravity. Then we got it going into a differential here, which runs those two wheels. A little drive shaft to a differential back there, right in those two wheels. And boy, does she go. What do you see? I did some playing around last night. <laughs> Scared the boys a little bit. It was worth it. Every minute of it, so. Well, that's a little walk around torque. Not too shabby. Check that out. A little dirty. But frame's perfectly straight. It's got a skid plate all the way underneath it from... Um, Right about here forward so everything's protected under there got a battery under the seat access for everything under the seat Let's see if i can pull this up hey. your motor's under there oil checking stuff battery i think we're going to get a bigger battery i don't want to depend on running the motor for that winch because if something happens with my motor and i still need a winch i want a winch anyway that's what we're going on going off of What do you think, guys? Should we take it for a spin? Okay, if we're going for a ride, let's check out the inside. He just got this back from service before he put it on the market. Just a nice oil change, everything checked out, had some stuff, that's when he put the winch on. It's a little loud in here. The motor's right there, I'm looking to do with some sound deadening. So, it's a good idea to wear some ear protection if you're really going. What do we got here? We got our all-wheel drive switch, which engages our front wheels. Um, we got this right here, which is a plug for our winch. That's where we're plugging our... We'll be using that a lot. Ignition key, choke, uh, pluggy do for chargers, which work. I put it in there. It works all the time, so I unplugged it in one drain the battery. And then we've got... Look, check this out. You know what that says? Pull for heat. <laughs> Year round using this baby. Headlights, hour meter. Fairly low hours. 400. I put the 1.7 on there last night. But, uh, we got a fan for ventilation. We've got this here, which is your defrosters, <laughs> which I needed in the rain yesterday. Oh my goodness, this thing fogged up until I opened that up. Then, uh, this is also really cool for when it's raining. Oh, yeah. One on both sides. You don't need to turn one on. Passengers over there, you can turn his on if he wants. <laughs> Hard top. There you go. Alright. Let's start this thing up. See what she'll do, huh? <laughs> oh, yeah. Here we go.
too easy. We need something a little bit harder. Let's try over there. Well, that was easy. I didn't even have it in all-wheel drive. Piece of cake. So, I'm wondering. I can take a shortcut over here. Because the road to the house is right over there. I can go back and all the way around, which would be fun. Let's see if this thing will bushwhack. What do you think? Well, there's only one problem here. We ain't gonna fit. So, you gonna go around. I move some stuff out of the way. Should be easy.
done being done that way. We've got a hill over here. Let's go see if we can conquer it. climb. up here you don't have to drive on pavement with these things we've got these side roads that go all the way along usually they follow the power lines keep you off the road it's a little rougher but that's what these things are for let's do it go catch a fish maybe I still can't believe we got it. Thanks. Couldn't have done it without you guys. Well, no, we made it down here in one of our fishing holes. I don't know if you can see that over there or not. All the brightness just changed. Sorry, but that is a huge ass mountain range. That's a rainbow lake. One more time, guys. This little thing right here would not be possible without our sponsors. You guys know who you are. Knew that we needed help. Came through for us. Filled in the gap. And we couldn't fill ourselves. That's how we work.
Anomi, she's Anomi, you're Anomi, wouldn't you like to be Anomi? Click the subscribe down on the bottom, click the like button down on the bottom, make a comment down on the bottom. Peace out.